have to also look at the pattern of every movement. Look at the feminist movement. It all started, you know, as a rescue mission to save women from their homes, to help them vote. And I think that some things were needed. Oh, the to feminist be movement, feminism. Was, that was the first part of this. Well, Honey, but yeah. it was like a saving grace. So that helped women feel like they had a safe space. But look at the escalation. Now, you want to talk about being a feminist and protecting women's rights? When we have men dressed up in women's heels, in dresses, winning all of our sports, going into little girls' shower rooms, completely perverting what a woman is and pretending like it's okay. It's like you want to talk about being a feminist, but yet we're yeah. here kneeling on our knees to the man. They use the word you need to use my pronouns out of respect mm -hmm. and they and they gaslight you and they make you look bad and they call you names over and over and they just keep repeating when in reality what they're trying to do is force someone to deny the biological reality and take away their right to say you have an Adam's apple even within gay culture or whatnot women are being told that they are transphobic if they are not willing to engage with a woman who has a penis do you understand how anti-woman that is? Mm -hmm. Yes. And that it's male dominance all over being called something else. Everyone in America knew children did not need to be muzzled. Mm -hmm. Their risk of COVID was essentially zilch. They no one knows that a biological man, a foot taller than girls winning a sport, is not the equivalent of a biological woman. Everyone knows that Dylan Mulvaney, sitting across from Joe Biden, representing women's voices, is farcical. So the more they can get us to accept absolutely nonsensical false things, the easier it will be. Overall, when you look at the racism, the sexism, everything is just to dehumanize everybody. That's what all of us as Americans need to remember is forget your pronouns. Our identity is the fact that we're all American here and we're here to fight the establishment.